Why would I pick the pipe over there? Holy <laughs> Come at me, bro. Whoa, welcome back, people. This is AP Biz, and I know I haven't released a video in quite some time, but I'm back in full throttle and trying to release new videos and new content for y'all to enjoy. Now, the game I'm gonna play today, or I'm showing y'all today, is Alone in the Dark, which is not that great, <laughs> to be honest, but we here to enjoy the video, enjoy the content. Hope you like, comment, subscribe. If you don't, it's fine. Your views matters as well. And we'll hopefully, y'all enjoy the video. Enjoy the video. Please enjoy the video. Please, please. If he's here, that's why. Yeah. Stand the experience with it. If it's intended, difficulty. Flash your time. the harder and resource off screen. Just take it easy and focus on the story. All right. Well, I'll do standard then. It's modern. Extra help provided to help. Old school for those who want to figure out everything for themselves. Nah, I, I ain't that good anymore. I used to be good. I'm like, blah. Oh, look at this frog. Look at this weird. All the body ain't moving. It's just this thing. Oh, god damn. <laughs> Does it look bad from this angle? Nope. So, your uncle. What's wrong with him? He's possessed. As in the devil? Something like that. He says a dark man is following him. Watching him at all times. What do you make of it? It's nonsense, of course. But I'd be lying if I said it didn't bother me. You see, it runs in my family. Possession? No, detective. Deteriorating melancholy. Oh. Practically every member of the Harwood family is driven mad before they grow old. But Jeremy didn't kill himself. Is that why he's at your setup? Despite being convinced that he is truly possessed, he decided to put his last chips on Dr. Gray and his psychoanalysis, figuring he might stumble upon some cure. But she has it. You mentioned the letter. I received a disturbing letter from Jeremy accusing the staff and all the other patients of being involved in some cult. And now they are also out to keep him. Could it be real? Or is it all just in his head? It's a story he tells himself, Mr. Carnby. Anything to avoid the truth. Which is? That we're all terribly insignificant. That people mean so very little to one another. That there is no one out to get Jeremy Hartwood because he isn't worth getting. Here we are. So far, so good. My uncle's not well, Mr. Carnby. I want to make sure he's all right. Then what's my part in this? You couldn't get a cab? I just wouldn't feel safe going alone. Did you bring a gun? Yeah. Of course I did. You think it'll actually come to that? No. But you might need to wave it around depending on how agreeable the staff will be. What exactly are we going to do when we find Jeremy? What is going on with his beard? I don't know. <laughs> Let's just find him first. What the hell? That's insane. Oh, what's this? Oh, I get to pick. I picked the car. I'm gonna pick this guy. I'm gonna start off with him first. Yeah. Hello. 
Hello? Hello? Looks abandoned. It can't be. There has to be someone around. Wait here. I'll go around back. So it's like playing Resident Evil all over again? What the hell am I doing now? Can I run? Yes, I can. Can I search? Yes, I can too. Ooh, that lighting. Huh. Now, what do we got here? A light, my man's. We need this shit. Clue. That's a clue? Kitchen garden key. Kitchen garden key. That's it. That's all the information we got. All right. All right. We got a little flashlight just in case. Can we open this door? No. Oh, the graphics say no. Can't go. Oh, I could go in here. All right. You tired already? After that baby jogging? I, uh, uh, uh. I'm in search mode. Let's see what we got. Ain't nothing. I didn't leave nothing behind. Who cares? Alright, let's go. Hello. I have the key. I work here. in there? Oh, I wasn't tripping. <laughs> nah, we don't need the light no more. We good. Nah, I'm not getting in there. Well, obviously. Fucking big padlock on it. Right, that's why. I'm pretty sure that's why I gotta go. Let me check the door over here first. Man, I was, hoping, I was hoping this was locked, and now I let me go check something out. I hate multiple places. Can I go in here? Let's see. Hmm. Oh, I can't. Never mind. We will continue. already holy shit okay <laughs> what the f I need the key Jesus Christ I need the key for everything here Can't open that one. All right, on to the next one. Can't open that one either. What's this? 
So alcohol is my healer. Love it. Can I go up these stairs? Nope. Get my energy back by drinking. Ain't that some stuff? Hmm. I need the key. And I'm already lost. In the beginning of the damn game. That is... Oh, wait, wait a second. Oh, there we go. I got it. Open that damn door. What? I got a trophy? Yep, it's my first time playing it, so. Just getting, getting Don't mind used if to I it. Do. Yeah, my man is a, a drinker. Let's go. All right, next one, next area. Let's go. Checking here. He gets exhausted after three seconds of jogging. Okay. Oh, somebody just left pistol bullets. Pistol bullets. In a book. Every day your silence weighs a little heavier. It's been a difficult year for everyone, and many have lost all hope. Oh. I read in the papers hmm. about people suffering. Pictures of dust covered landscapes without a drop of water. I wish I knew if you were still tending the earth or if you had turned your back against us. I have started to look for help elsewhere. I pray you will tell me if I am going down a path that you find disagreeable. With help from Batiste and Charlotte, Batista. I found comfort in the practice of the voodoo. I have long been skeptical of that Caribbean cult, but... It's been of good use to me. It seems all harmless in my book. I say some words dreamt up by the Creoles, and I carry around a small pocket of gris, gris Nothing of this is mentioned in the Bible, of course, but the French Quarter Priestess tells me it's all connected. She says the Christian God is just one more perspective on the creator of things. That's what I like to think, but... The other way around that the spirits of her faith are just aspects of you our heavenly father i am so grateful for holy the shit as long as hell Hartwood. we will sing your praises at saint john's <laughs> eve the world will be blessed soon again only the sacrifices of the old testament uh. compare to your demands let it be the truth a mother of earth Wood and dirt. Oh, I thought you earth, wood, and fire. And young. Earth, wood, and fire. Sacred sand, one dollar. Black cat oil, dollar fifty. Devil shoe strings, a quarter. That makes two dollars and seventy-five cents, madame. What was that you were telling the doctor? A goat without horns. What does that mean? Ah, uh, is... you must have... What is going on? <laughs> I thought the dialogue was over. It just kept on going. I'm pretty sure that's gonna be a puzzle. So, two two seventy five. More alcohol. Mm hmm. No mind if I do. Oh, physics. that and it's not throughout the game completely set will uncover okay understood so playing both campaigns will definitely unlock more stuff gotcha I like it I like that they did that gives you a little bit of replayability Oh, more alcohol. Lovely. But oh, there's a lot of stuff to check. I did not know. Wow. OK. 
Okay. Is this where I came from? Is there a map? This. Oh, it's a, there's a crouch button. That's the aim, obviously. That's to look at something. I always, I don't think there's a map in this game. I really gotta, oh, here we go. I gotta go this way. It's already. I'm doing good. I need the key. Oh, well, well. My worst enemy. A locked door. All over again. Do not touch the boiler. It is working after all. While the sabotage has caused a leak, only the decorative plate has been completely ruined. Let's wait for Mr. Chance to turn up and he can take a look at the leak. Mr. Waits. Mr. Waits? Oh. <laughs> That's on my island wave over here. Okay. It goes a puzzle. Pretty sure I can go through there, so. Hmm. Oh, you're missing pieces. What? That doesn't look safe. You could just crawl under it, but uh, you know it's, it's it's a horror game, you know. I like that there's a lot to search, and uh, the house looks nice. Looks peaceful. Is locked or needs to be broken? I don't know. More alcohol. A bowl of drinks. Sunday, June twenty second. I spent all day looking for Jeremy. I should have cared for the others, but I'm scared that he will do something irreversible. Cassandra is upset that I didn't give her the latest shipment of pain medication that Waits brought from the post office yesterday. I would have given it to her, but the company didn't send a new key this time around, so the box is just sitting there on my desk. They must have figured we had plenty of their gimmicky keys by now. I only remember seeing one lately. Grace was playing with it inside the grand parlor. Unless it turns up by itself, it will have to wait. I have to figure out where Jeremy is. I think Jack knew something. That dog of his found a strange rot permeating the house. Yeah. She's showing us, he said. Like those blots and streaks of fetid rot was talking to him. All right. Let's see what's going on now. So I got that. Lock medicine box. Obviously, I don't got the key. Uh, oh, okay. Look at this. 
there is a map. Nice. Now I know where the hell I need to go. Oh, what the hell? I don't see what we gotta say first. Key item. This is a uh, plaza key. Good. This is what I wanted to do. Yeah. Nice. Now I know I gotta open up the map. This is the library. This is plaza key. Oh yeah. Oh, I like this. It got a lot of floors, a lot of doors. Oh, what's this? It's wedged shut. Hmm. Looks important. Oh, let's say it's private. I would think it is, it is important. My lord. Don't jump down, my man. The locked door, huh? Alright. All right. What the? <laughs> Thanks. What are you doing? Who are you? Whoa, pardon me. Excuse me. My name is Edward Carnby, private investigator. I hope you don't mind we let ourselves inside. I do mind. This is private property. You can't just barge in here. I'm sorry about all this, but I'm looking for my uncle. It's urgent, and no one was answering the door. We can't hear you knocking anymore. None of us can. Huh? Who is your uncle, darling? Who is this woman? Hold on, people. Am I right? She has that Hartwood gloom, doesn't she? That's right. I'm Emily Hartwood. I just came to make sure my uncle is all right. Well, he is unavailable right now. He will have to come back another day. Unavailable? How? Is he sleeping? We can wait. He's lost. Look, don't I know you from somewhere? Who's your man again, Miss Hotwood? My name's Edward Carnby, uh, private investigator. Splendid. Enough, all of you. Get back to your rooms. McCarthy, keep your eyes on the child. And you two, please leave immediately. Look, we're not here to cause any trouble. Just. Let us see the old man, satisfy the curiosity of my client here, and we'll be off. Jeremy has gone missing. There's no need to worry, but it might be some time before he turns up. The whole staff is looking for him. What? He ran off? I don't have time for any of this. Please, come back tomorrow. All right, in that case, we'll just wait in his room. You don't mind, do you? It's upstairs, right? Wait, you can't. Don't worry, we'll be discreet. In the corridor. It's the first door on your left. I'll tell Dr. Gray you're here. Excellent. Thank you, madam. He's gonna barge in like that. That's crazy. Let's look around, see if we can dig up any clues. Alright, search Jeremy Hoon for clues. Lock box, obviously. Puzzles. Not the puzzles. Heard there's a lot of puzzles in this game, and it's like one of the best features in the game, so. Conversation? Anything important I should look out for? Did he keep a diary? Not that I know of, but it wouldn't surprise me. That's locked. Oh, choppy. Look at the mirror. Oh, shit. <laughs> what the hell? All right, let's keep on looking, shall we? Wasting time.
Every night the dark man stands opaque at the threshold of my room, counting the days until my spirit spills out of my tired shape. Only his pallid mask shelters my remaining sanity, staring directly into the face of that demonic sultan would surely sunder time itself. Would he have looked the same to my father as he struggled for his life? He did. Does his veiled face haunt my niece quite the hey, same man, way? Hey, man, what's up, bro? How you doing? I wish so that I could rest my soul in that sunburnt convent of Tarawaya. Would I find you there, Juan? Or Senora Pierosi? Back from the beyond? Every night I hide from him. Moving from one misshapen memory to another. Hey, what's up, bro? Things How you doing today? Out of fantasy and delirium. Places I struggle to even paint. I wish I understood your death, Senora. Is there anything I could do for you but bury you in that bleak necropolis? That triumphant chapel rising above the ledges and the oven vaults shall be oh, your I'm trying out this game for the first time. Rest. And I shall hear a lot of negative things about it, but so far so good. I know I'm just in the beginning, so Let me see how it goes after. Oh my god, yeah. Alright. Painted tiles. Where are we going? Here? Oh my god. <clears throat> oh, that's simple. <laughs> I thought I was gonna have a problem with this. Hey, you know anything about this? Looks like some sort of talisman. No, I don't. Oh, help me out here, will you? Help me out here. <laughs> I would have killed a guy to throw some of this stuff out. I'd be crazy too if I had this much junk lying around. Max. Hey, Nick, what's up, man? Good morning. <laughs> oh, wow. That's striking. I want to save this one. It's, this guy makes me want to watch Stranger Things again. When is the new season coming out? Waiting. Dr. Gray. Come on, let's go. Yeah, I'm coming. Miss Hartwood. Emily? change I did not know if this is how it goes oh shoot I didn't look up too much of the game like video wise and reviews because I just wanted to see everything for myself so I didn't even know they had like a silent hill type thing going on speaking of silent hill man I can't wait for silent hill to come out all right, where are we going? <sighs> oh, 
my first enemy. Well, I got just 26 bullets. I ain't even worried. Yeah. There we go. Christ, what the hell was that? Ah! Holy shit, it was one of the <laughs> I suck. Ah! I mean, it's not a terrible thing. I just don't want to get hit. Oh, I said I don't want to get hit. <laughs> Little green people. <laughs> okay. As we continue. Wasted like almost 14 bullets in that encounter. That's crazy. No wonder they gave me so much. They knew I was going to be... Sp I can't go that way. Why can't he go this way? Uh-oh. Invisible wall. Uses what is going on? Why am I walking so damn slow? I'm trying to sprint. Oh, it's because I'm holding knife. That was a distraction, all right. I didn't hear not a goddamn thing. Can I use my map? map is of no use here okay what's in here nothing onward can you ride the bike wake me up before you go I don't know what I saw was in my head <laughs> oh, what's this motro shit who am I hitting with this? There is nobody there to throw this at. Who am I throwing this at? Who? Hey, yeah. Damn, the sound effects is gone. Bro, I don't know where the hell I'm going. It's foggy as hell. This is Silent Hill. Can't go that way. It's too foggy. He just say shit like that. Let me open this. Nope. Mm. Key. I need the key. Garbage. Bullets inside. Nope. A weapon. A hatchet. Nice. How do I use the hatchet? There. I can't right. go that way. No, he cannot go anywhere. All right, no problem. That's right, ten times. Is that bullets? So I love that the game is not ho um, holding hands. Oh, okay, hold on a second. I think I found where to go. All right. What's this? Oh, there's different weapons. Hey. Why would I pick the paint over there? Holy shit! <laughs> oh, ah. Come at me, bro. Can the weapons break? Yes, I'm noticing them right there on the bottom of the screen. Okay. Ah! 
Holy jumping me. My weapon broke. Oh, like I haven't noticed. Alright, let's go get the pipe. Why are you jogging? Where's the sprint button? Oh. Oh. Where you at? I mean, the combat is a little clunky. Let me not lie, but it's all right. It's playable. It's playable. It's playable. Mm, that tastes good. We out of here. I can't go that way. I feel like something's gonna happen when I do that. That's why I'm pressing the button. <laughs> oh shit. <gasps> Don't let them get inside, Carl Bear. They're not the good guy. Are you. Is this your store? There are no owners here. We both strangers in Jeremy's story. Jeremy did this. How? I'd be scared I, as hell you come up man. Jeremy warned us, but we didn't think much of it. I'm Detective Edward Carnby. I was hired by Jeremy's niece to find him. Oh, yeah? How much you paying you? $150. Baby <laughs> mm. money. She's sure getting her money's worth tonight. Are you a thanking man, Compare? No, not if I can help it. You know, I think Jeremy's hiding in the way we can't find him. He has this juju necklace that guides him. The talisman? That's right. It's some magic charm what he is... got for Miss Jackson. They really have street. a problem with the crowd. Voodoo priestess. His beard is you know crazy. You surprising things, compare. Yeah, the mama lower. Here, take the key. I locked the gate to save her place from all the ghouls and goblins getting inside. Maybe if you go there, you can find some clues to show you the way. Thanks. I'll have a look. Oh, my fault. Oh yeah, that's the guy from Stranger Things. He's also in a couple other things too, though. But I know him vaguely from Stranger Things. Okay, what is this stuff? Oh, another item. Okay. He's probably gonna kill me. I can't go behind there. All right. Oh, yes. Give me the bullets. All oh, the bullets. What you doing behind my counter? Oh, I look like something you can read. Let me talk to him. You want to come along? Nah. I'm gonna stay here for a while. I'm invested. I want to finish this. I thought I was going to be one of, these, one of these type of games that I was going to get sick and tired of in the beginning and just drop off. But I want to actually see how the story goes and finish it. I just hope it's not too difficult. <laughs> Maybe I'll play the other one with the girl too. Who knows? But right now, I'm interested. In, oh, he's just looking at me from the window. Oh, new monster. New monster, come over here. You're dancing over there. Uh, ding, ding, ding. Get in here. The match has started. Ah. Every time he shoots, he goes, ah. Oh, so it's a six bullet rule in this game. So far, everything has been down with six bullets. Okay.
Oh, how, have you, uh, obviously you played it, right? How far did you get in the game or did you finish it? So I got that key. Yeah. I always, I'm, I'm a, a big fan of horror games. Mystery, horror, suspense, you know, all that thriller stuff. And I have brought in this game when it first came out, but I just have not touched it until now because there's other things I was playing or doing. And I said, you know what? I want to play this game. I want to stream it, see how people feel about it. And... So far, yeah. I like it. I mean, like I said, the combat is a little wonky. But I can do with it. If the story is good, decent at least, I will chug through the game, even if the combat is not as great as other games. So I'm definitely going to go through it. Try to finish it at least. Uh oh. Oh. Oh, my God. My aim is disgusting. Okay. Oh. Oh, my Okay, I'm sorry for the bad aiming. Oh my god, the slow walking. Damn. I feel bad now. I'm gonna run out of bullets before I even, uh. Well, oh, that's dark as hell. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I just love the horror genre, man. It's even, there's even some old school PlayStation 2 games that I would love to try out that I never got the chance to play because I was afraid. Uh oh. <laughs> All right, let me see if I can throw this at him. Ah! Oh. Did that kill him? Nope. No. <laughs> ah! Fuck. Wow. Two of them don't kill him? What's this? What's this? Where you at? I lost him. Oh, he died. <laughs> Got you. Well, I'm sold already. And I like the, the exploring, too. I know I complain about the doors and all the doors locked, but I like that stuff. I like to go back and trip back to... Oh, my Lord. <laughs> what the hell, man? Just, uh, okay, so now I know this game is known for having... Uh, having uh, <laughs> monsters around the corner all the time. Okay, no problem. So that matters. Let's go. No, no, no. What are you doing? There's an item over here. There we go. I recognize this place. It's Miss Jackson's seance parlor. It's huh. the talisman, like the one in the painting. In between. There's a door. There are doors. Wonder what this is. Old talisman shape, home of centuries, then engraving on numbers look like less than a hundred years old, but this is basically from antiquity. The polished black sunstone in the middle of the glass finishes occasionally gives the impression of hi of hiding the picture within itself. Can I view it? Oh, it's not 3D-ish. Okay. Oh, it goes in I here. I think it's meant for the talisman. Puzzle. I think it needs numbers, like coordinates. Maybe there's something in Jeremy's notes. Um, 
man, look for the number combination on your talisman. Oh, we gotta go through notes. Uh oh. Which one? Jeremy? I had Jeremy notes. I don't think I have Jeremy notes. Uh oh. Was I not paying attention? Oh, is it this one? 358? I agree. I agree 100% with you. Three. Four. I'm not too sure what the hell is going on. This is confusing as hell. Oh, I didn't look at the side of the screen. <laughs> Jesus. There we go. Wow. It's showing something. A place? Where is that? So that's what the story is basically about, like just sticking up to family. Damn, I'm confused. Detective, I was wondering when you were going to show up. Mrs. Thompson told me you were here. Damn. I understand you are working for Jeremy Hartwood's niece. Uh, well, they definitely yeah, gotta fix a couple of I things guess here. So, <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. We came here for her uncle. I just didn't expect. I didn't expect this. You are Dr. Gray, right? That's right. You don't happen to have some identification, Detective. I'm not keen on having strangers prying into my business. Oh. Detective Edward Carnby, Decatur Street, New Orleans. Enjoying the view carré, Detective? Those old French quarters, the voodoo people, the gangsters. I'm sure you live an exciting life. Well, that's not quite like the stories, Doc. Just trying to make a living. Aren't we all making a living? Well, welcome to Dossetto, Detective. I hope your time here will be useful. Now, what can I do for you? Why don't you tell me where I can find Jeremy Hartwood? <laughs> Why wouldn't that make for a short visit? Seeing, seeing the blood on the I on wish the I character. could tell you, but I'm afraid I don't know. A drink, detective? Anything brandy. Oh, you do belong in the French quarters, detective. Armagnac or cognac? Cognac. You know, just give me the cheap stuff. I'm not much of a connoisseur. Which is the cognac. Having low standards is not a virtue, detective. Let me see if I can broaden your perspective. What can you tell me about Jeremy? I wouldn't want to go into details about his condition. Doctor-patient confidentiality. I'm sure you understand. Sure. But he is crazy. And he's gone missing. Why? Here. Try this. Oh, it's good. Got a bite. <laughs> it's called a sidecar. The trick is not to be afraid of the tartness of the lemon. Then, for goodness sake, don't overdo the triple sec. Okay, what can you tell me about Jeremy? Ah, oh, well, let me think. He is an anxious man, constantly worried about events not presenting themselves according to his model of predestination. 
Mm. He complains about things not being carried out in the right order, and that some things simply shouldn't be. Is any of this helpful to you? Uh, not really. Uh, I was hoping for some direction where to look next. I'm sorry. I have nothing for you then. You should talk to my orderlies. They have been looking for him for a while now. I'm sure they would appreciate your help. Yeah, I ran into Batiste earlier. Come to think of it, he... He might have given me a lead. Oh, excellent. So your investigation is already underway. Alright. I'm gonna go. But I'm sure we'll meet again. Looking forward to it. That's a Safe fact. returns. Oh, I'm in chapter two already. Nice. I also heard the game wasn't Detective that long, Carter? too. How did you... Where did you go? I was just talking to Dr. Gray. You disappeared. No, I know. It's not what you think. Have you... Have you found anything strange going on here? Yes. Everyone is being incredibly evasive and I can't figure out why. No, I mean something you can't explain. Paranormal, even. Detective, I really need you to get yourself together. I can't do this alone. Forget it. I'll figure it out. Uh-huh. Joey Carla. Do you want to come see Dr. Gray? No. I want to I want to try something out. With this talisman, I think I can follow Jeremy to the place he mentioned in the book. What was the name? Do you remember something Spanish? Tarawea. Yeah, that's where I need to go. Detective, are you gonna be alright? Yeah, of course. Go talk to Dr. Gray. We'll rendezvous later. Oh, my God. What is up? Oh. See, that's what I'm interested to. I'm interested in to see her side of the story as well, because I know... This talisman brought me back from the French uh -oh. Quarter in the blink of an eye. If okay. Jeremy can travel so easily, then he could be hiding anywhere, even Tarawea. If he can do it, so can I. I just need to figure out how the talisman works. I'm I'm addicted to hitting that bell. What's this? Yes. Lost children. That's a fact. It's hard to work when you're definitely under those conditions when people actually do think that you're not right up in the head. I saw your notice in the boiler room. You should know Mr. Chance won't be coming back. I got no business being in there myself, but you can take a valve from the wine cellar if you want to try to stop the steam pouring out. Be careful. Thank you, sir. I appreciate the help. Oof, that's a lot of keys. Dr. Elmore Lee Gray is DeSetto's chief doctor. Accounting and all administrative work is handled by me. Paul Waits. Magdalena Thompson, or Mags, is responsible for the household. Jean-Baptiste and Charlotte Tabois are responsible for keeping the guests' medical regiments in check. Finally, Jack Chance is our gardener, who can occasionally be seen in the conservatory, but is for the most part busy outside. There are currently six... Okay, there's a lot to look at, Jesus Christ. Uh-oh. That's the girl from the demo. Room number one. 
I'm gonna stick this is the one I'm going to right now actually. Da, 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 da. Reason for admission, personal history, confused and suffering, partial amnesia. She insists that she belongs here. She offered to pay for her stay. Diagnostic impression. Woof. Looks like all the patients are accounted for, except for Jeremy. There's no way I can get into this thing. Better leave it alone. That's facts. I don't know. Facts. All right, all right, all right, all right. Paul, you're right about the plates on the boiler and the clock. They have been sabotaged, and I think I know who did it. They have something to do with Jeremy's episodes and how he seems to disappear at night. Right now, it's important that you keep an eye out for any of the pieces. I want to find out if I can repair the plates. Let me know if you find any of them. Lottie. Tell Lottie to take a look at the well in the kitchen garden. All right. Jesus Christ, there's so much stuff to look for in this game. Good Lord. All right. I need the key. Obviously, I don't have the key to that yet. All right, continue. Did I walk in here already? Oof, I'm confused a little bit. Hold on. Okay, the main hall. I have the key to room number six. Let me go check that out real quick. Oh, what is going on up here? Good Lord, puzzle after puzzle. Oh. Whoa, yeah, cutscene uh, after cutscene. Sorry, detective. Didn't mean to obstruct justice or anything. That's fine. You know, I'm kind of busy with my own case of a missing person. I was wondering if you've seen Grace, girl about yay high. Can't say that I have. Why are you asking? Well, I'm looking for her. Is she in trouble? No, 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 no. Uh, she's just uh, hiding somewhere. But we can't have a rascal like that running around unchecked at a time like this, you understand? Well, I haven't seen her. Well, let me know if you find her. I'll be around. Uh, I'll keep an eye out for your man. Jeremy, you scratch my back, detective, and I'll scratch yours. Everybody's weird in this shit. Everybody. <laughs> Looks like everything's back to normal here. Be able to unlock unlocks the shotgun cabinet. All right. Mm. Bullets, please. No. Okay. Nothing. Ew. Roaches. This has to be the wrong key. Yep. Let me check this real quick and then we'll go in there. Oh, a 
Okay. No, don't close on me. Huh. How eccentric. What are these symbols? Looks like alchemy or star constellations. Jesus, there's always something. I did it. I crossed the thresholds to my intended destination without a focusing device. My talisman now knows these roads, and I have no need for the plates. I can find my way to Lafayette as easy as I find my own room. I visited the grave of my father and seen the oven waiting for me. Thank you for opening these doors. I now must summon my courage and go back to that hateful mound outside the oil rig. I hope you'll be feeling better when I return. Jeremy. Okay. Onward. Let's see what else we got. More puzzles. Good lord. These paintings got some grim looking rot on them. Understanding. Fuck. Obviously, something's up with that. Complete the chase with the rock on the way. Oh shit, hold on, I think I know exactly what I gotta do. Yeah. Hmm. I got it right, what happened? Ah, oh, now I gotta figure something out. You start a artist colony. I remember hearing about their disappearance. Must have been 15 years or more now. Will I need to remember how to get them out again? They are locked up for good reason. I am sure she is still able to whisper the answer in the ears of the wrong people. But not for long. I will see her burn soon enough. That black goat will be sacrificed to put an end to it all. Then it will all be over. No more Derseto, and sadly, no Astarte. Those good pirates of Poncha train. May you still sail the lake until you find the shores of Hali. I see 11011. 11011. Don't see I need to look at the wall. Water. Or oh, whatever the sun is in. Oh, oh, I'm not too sure. Maybe I'm reading it wrong. Maybe I'm reading it wrong. Let's see. Crap. Whoa. Okay. Maybe there's something I'm missing with the whole this but I just don't know exactly Impossible. I'm not gonna figure this out. 
don't even know what I'm looking for. Three hours later. Well, maybe I'll just change one more thing up. Man. I don't know. Oh, that was random. <sighs> Got it. It's a wild guess at the end. Oh, oh shit. Can I touch that? One piece. We need more. Hmm. I need the key. I need the key. There's no way I can get into this thing. Better leave it alone. I don't mix that sound every time. <laughs> Jesus Christ. There's just so much to look for, I don't even know where the hell to go. Lost Plantations of Louisiana, Thierry Bridlow, 1917. The Assetto was a small plantation on the eastern shore of Lake Pontchartrain. The land was considered difficult for industry and was sold for only $30 to Elia Pickford in 1818. Pickford employed hundreds of workers from nearby New Orleans to clear the woods and build a small plantation mansion. Okay, that's gonna be long. I'm gonna have to read that one later. Where I came from? It's a new area to me. Jesus. I was with a wedge. It's a wedge shot. Yeah.
loud as hell. What the hell is going on? Oh, there is a shotgun here. Break it. Oh no, you telling me the gunshot did not break the damn thing. Wow. Oh, I didn't see this before. I must have skipped it. Or they just put it there. Hmm. the other piece the bow cutters oh, here's the bow cutters here yes Said what I said. <laughs> okay, now I'm making some progress. Good lord. Uh oh, here we go. I'm stuck again. Okay. I'm good. I'm good. Keep seeing those eyes in there, but just I just wasted a bullet. God damn it. Let's just take the ladder. I'm tripping. All right, let's let's go back. There we go. I think I've seen this somewhere. Oh, here we go again. Oh, we gotta puzzle this stuff out. Oh. Hmm. 
Four hours later. Oh! Jesus. I think the glass <laughs> broke. Or maybe it just stopped at a very precise place. Four, six. Huh. I mean, that's what stopped that. Oh, let me look at it again. Sorry. The big one, small one. Small one is three. Middle one is four. Big one is six. Hours later, six. There's a picture in the black glass. It's showing me something. It's the hallway outside Jeremy's room. Okay, there we go. Jeremy's room. Oh. It's like Alan Wake over here. Jeremy's memories. Ugh. Oh, can you use the boat cutters for that? May 1923, Monday. All okay, ready for delivery. Maintenance, oil pump must be serviced. Any tampering causes large spills unless properly forestalled. Tuesday, shipment delayed but delivered. Maintenance, service bridge close to broken. Wednesday, prospectors reluctantly agreed to show the burial mound to Mr. Hotwood, the painter, who read about our finds in the papers. He means to return tomorrow and try to find a way inside. Yeah, the puzzles are Thursday. for sure. But Mr. Hartwood's efforts delayed. The workers seemed nervous about his presence. The Hartwood promised not to return to the compound. Instead, he has taken up an offer by L'Officier, the riverboat captain. He means to pilot him to the site tomorrow morning. Hopefully, that's the end. The work can resume. Maintenance. Bridge from the oil tower to the bayou has collapsed. Sabotage suspected. This is the devil that guides us now. <laughs> this is the hmm. devil. 
Wrench. Nope. Okay. No items for me. No item here either. Okay, okay. Nothing. Not a goddamn thing for me. Sad. That's the door I came from. I need the key. People for answer and sex. Oh, look at that. There's something missing. to something. Mm. Finally, I got a side weapon again. Oh no, don't want to go in that. Oh no, that's, that's just the floor. It's <laughs> another weapon? Oh no, separation over. <sighs> got it. Change the mode. I was three bullets for him. Beautiful. I came up here for nothing. Is this a... Well, I got a pipe. Well, 
That's all it was. Nothing else. Oh, that's where I gotta go. Oh, my hat. Bunch of weapons over here. Shovel, take a nap. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Oh. You know, there's open stuff, and there's no items in there. Jesus. No. Oh, more healing. More healing. There's a whole bunch of alcohol everywhere. Good Lord. something to break it. There we go, some pistol buttons. Love it. for me to replenish I hear you outside I hear you I hear you what was that Over here, bullets. Yes, thank you. Shit, I don't want to go. We went into this door. There's a sneaking. Oh, we ain't sneaking nowhere. Let me go over here and check some.
fuck. Well, my pistol bullets is actually full. That's a new one. Okay. leave the uh, the weapon at oh I gotta go back and grab one Side. It's on, we'll find it. Uh, it's pretty good. I think the puzzles are a little difficult. Gameplay wise, not the best. I, I, I'll be honest with you on that. I'm not gonna lie to you. But uh, so far the story is interesting. And I'm, I'm gonna finish it. I'm gonna die. What am I doing? Oh, I gotta climb. <laughs> attention to what the hell I need to do.
Sword cloth. Yeah, come on, Carby. Wouldn't you rather fall to your death than go up in flames? Okay, here we go. Like I said, I, I, the story seems pretty interesting, so I'm definitely invested in that. But some people could be turned off by just the lack of the, the way the combat in this game. It's not as potent as other games. So. And the graphics is not that up there too, but I can live with it. Give me a good story and I'll shoot by it. Obviously, we can't fight that yet. Maybe it's a sneaking section. That's why they teach you how to sneak in this game. Which... How do I sneak? I don't trust that thingy. I'm about to run because it's slow as hell. It's the hateful mound Jeremy talked about in his book. Ah, right, there we go. More cutscenes. thing out of my face who are you who what are you doing here i'm just a detective trying to find something called tearaway yeah, after jeremy too why i'm working for his niece she wants to make sure he's all right he might be unharmed but far from all right he's a curse upon deceto oh, here we go again quiet Oh no, she gonna die. Oh, she not gonna die. That shotgun is getting me pissed. It's like right there and I can't get it for some reason. Come on, break it. Oh my Jesus Christ. How are you going to sit there and just tease me with a damn shoddy? All right. Back to whatever the hell I'm going now. Okay. Um. It was a bust. The oil rig. They gotta be supported. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, okay. I know what that'll go. I know what's Reflections on the power of the verb in certain texts by Juan Luis Jorge. Juan. To act is in itself divine. Even the slightest movement of our hand is evidence of our soul in motion. 
Yet our free will is so easily overwhelmed by the dullness of everyday life. Our actions become rote and rigid in spite of luxury and comfort. True divinity is found in the choice of leaving the stage where we all perform. People who discover this freedom unexpectedly... Oh, unexpectedly stop you from talking. Sitting room key. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for giving me uh, a whole bunch of stuff. Puzzle. That's puzzle solve, right? I haven't got that one yet. And then the treatment room. The dining room. The block door. That's the one I gotta go to. Mm hmm. And the sitting room key. Where's the sitting room key at? I don't see no other. Oh, there we go. Bolted door. The sitting room key is on the top floor. Got it. I know I'm at. Wait, I think I know I'm at. Okay. It's wedge shot. All right, that's why I got this. It worked. Where the, Where are you running? Yo, he just started running by himself to the left. What the fuck? The Barlow Lens. Instructions. To double the magnification of your telescope, simply fit this Barlow Lens to your instrument. Then operate the fine tuners to adjust the distance between your lenses. This is easily done while looking through your eyepiece. Simply search for a position where your picture is clear and appears flat. When correctly tuned, your telescope should present a clear picture with magnificent magnification. Okay. You got it. Hey, yes, I finished the whole thing. Unlocks the shotgun cabinet. <gasps> is that what the shotgun is at? What's this? Can I grab it now? Don't, don't lie to me. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. Now we're talking. So don't. All right. Okay. The library. We're going upstairs right now. smoking over there oh here we go <laughs> what the hell <laughs> oh 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 my god i'm a god of dumbness regain your health why they put two bad guys next to me like this yo Crazy man.
That is messed up, man. You just made me. Oof. <laughs> Whatever. All right. It's wedged shut. It worked. Oh, God, I didn't want to do a cutscene. So Detective Conby, how good of you to come. Let me pour you a drink. What happened here? This place looks like it was hit by a bomb. <laughs> Welcome to the madhouse, Detective. Thanks. Did the ceiling just collapse? I heard it was something in the attic. Something that was supposed to happen, but didn't. How that could have such consequences is beyond me. The truth is, I don't know why the room looks like this. But I bet your friend Jeremy does. You know where I could find him? Oh, somewhere in his past, I suppose. He keeps going on about that mysterious dark man. I think he is hiding from him. Or maybe he's with him. I can't really keep up. I don't worry much. Take a look around this room. You may think it looks spectacularly devastated, but I just think it's finally found its stride. It fits perfectly with the state of this place and its loonies. The same loonies. goes for the nonsense with Jeremy. In my eyes, we finally managed to match the wild ride inside all of us. Well, I'm happy you find the evening still harmonious. I uh, hope you don't mind me setting things right. Jeremy's business, that is. This room looks beyond my capabilities. Good luck, detective. Hope to see you again soon. Yeah, evening, miss. Okay. All the crazy weird people in this show. In this establishment. Can I get some more of that whiskey? Go ahead, detective. I don't think I can stomach any more anyway. All right, so give me the whiskey. Am I bothering you? On the contrary, detective. I enjoy watching professionals at work. Sweet baby Jesus. All right, we out. Let's see. Another weird... Nothing's weird about living in here? You don't see nothing weird? There's another door I need to unlock, actually. Which has to be on this side. Mm-hmm. That's going to take me right to the sitting room, which is right here. Something missing. Puzzles after puzzles. Must be that. Don't you worry, Grace. Go play your game, bleat and bellow with the others. I won't be jealous. There will be more masquerades. However, I would love it if you would finish my mask for the feast. With love. His room. Why does she seem so familiar? 
This is Grace Room from the demo. I think. Jesus, cutscene after cutscene. I love it though. <laughs> what do you got there? You drawing something? Nothing special. I'm just bored. Do I know you from somewhere? I remember you, Mr. Conby. From where? Don't touch that. Cassandra wouldn't like it. She wouldn't like it at all. Do you know where she is? Cassandra, nobody. I'd rather not talk about it. It makes me upset. Besides, she'll be back after the Feast of St. John. You think? Yep. It's all on the page, Mr. Conby. And many of them that sleep in the dust of the earth shall awake, some to everlasting life, and some to shame and everlasting contempt. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm gonna go now, if that's okay. I don't like to stay too long in the same place. Mr. McCarthy might find me. Hey. Does he mean to you? Not everyone needs to be saved, Mr. Conby. You should know that by now. What are you talking about, girl? Stop being cryptic. Everything's a clue that you picked up. Miss Beauregard, <laughs> I picked up your medicine at the post office today. As you understand, it needs to be administered by the orderlies for your safety. I have put the box in Lottie's room for now, and I'm sure she will find you as soon as possible. Mr. Waits. Uh-oh. Another puzzle. It's another oh, one of those no. strange padlocks. There's more of that rod again. Like it's guiding me to do something. If I find the full set of bottles, then maybe I can make something out of the stains of rot. Well, obviously. Water closet. What, what happened to me? Look crazy. I'm looking the opposite way too. <laughs> Oop, that mirror messed up. Take it before. No, I took it. All right, cool. Thank God I came back for it. Then. The medicine bottles had stains of rot on the labels, suggesting some greater shape. They just needed to be put in the right order. But for what purpose? Find the gate to the medicine box in the back of the room. Find a combination for the lock. Those are all things I don't know. The hell is. There's the other one. 
Lottie's going to win. Let's see, let's see. Grand parlor. Yeah, I won't be able to go into the grand parlor though. How? Is that way? Oh. Okay, I think I know where to go. Up or down do I go? Yeah, let's go to the attic first. Nothing, as always. Medicine box for me. Look, the stuff I needed too. Crazy. Nice. Huh. Forbidden knowledge. What, what does that mean? Nothing. Every time I open these things, not one damn item. No. Oh. There's more of that aggressive rot. On the commonplace of evil, there lies virtue and stark irreverence, careless thoughts of luminous indifference. But blame not the beast we once were. Which science so often wished to refer. Not the wicked full of sin. It is you who stand and grin. All our good intentions aside. Whereupon we build our pride. Love it. Continue. Let us continue this journey. For a bit more. Okay, so I have unlocked that door. I ain't unlocked the door in Grand Parlor, though. Let me go do that one, too. 
There's a door and that'll lock you. Yep. Is it this door or the other door? Okay, it's this door. Oh, it's locked on the other side of the door. Oh, right, all right, all right, all right. I was confused. So I have the key to the oh, body room right there. Oh, okay. So I'm close to it. Nice. So I did that already, so what will be next on the list? to go upstairs to do the puzzle in Cassandra's room I think so let's see I can't go there that's locked door go down Cassandra's room yes going this way Jesus, a lot of traveling. All right, continue to rot. the shape of a snake there must be something important to find here maybe it has something to do with the numbers on the labels five seven what is it two five oh okay okay God damn it. <laughs> Should be it. There we go. Oh, I think 
Okay, I'm gonna do this little part right here and then I'm gonna stop. Ugh. I've been playing for a little bit longer than I thought. I like it though, I like it. I like the game. Alright, the boiler room or whatever the case may be. Where is I'm going now? Downstairs, obviously. All the way to the boiler room, yeah. Whoa, so there's a dodge button. See, I didn't know. If I would have known, I would have done it. So again, my ass whooped by them two <laughs> green bastards. Boiler room, boiler room. I'm going downstairs. Did I get to the boiler room before? Boiler room is right here. You know, Mr. Waits, I saw a piece of the plate that Liza broke. I think I got that already. It's another plate for the talisman. Like the other one, it's broken and missing some pieces. Damn, was this one piece? Oh my lord. I thought I had another one. So I'm 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 a, I'm guessing I'm missing something. Jesus. That means I gotta find something I haven't Unlocked yet. Oh, look at this. Sorry, Promise I didn't, you, I, Mr. Hartwood is I nowhere near my for, kitchen, and neither should you be. Don't make I, me I kick you out to, of this house. Sorry. Now get out. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Heard them cats? Well, looks like I ain't getting in there. Locked, that's locked. Clerk office is locked. The drawing room is the only puzzle I haven't did yet. And I'm gonna leave that for a second playthrough because man's gotta eat. Alright, man. Appreciate everybody that joined in, man. Thank you for watching. Game's interesting, man. Um, problems and hiccups here and there, but nothing too severe that I can't finish the game. So, should be like two or three more playthroughs, and I'll be sh sure to beat it, actually, man. But interesting, nonetheless. But I'll catch y'all later. Hopefully, I'll see you in the next one, man. Be safe, and have a great day, man.